welcome President Tuban first. Um, I look forward to your constructive <coughs> discussion over two uh, next two days. Uh, once again, let me extend a warm welcome to all of you, everyone here, and uh, thank, thank you so much, and enjoy your time, enjoy your trip, and enjoy your weather in Korea. Thank you so much. Is the director Shigeru Aoyaki with his welcome remarks? Please welcome him. Well, today we are together here to discuss and reflect on the, what is the safety school, school safety, and what is the implications of safety of the schools on the quality of education. <clears throat> we have to look at two aspects in terms of the safety schools. School is for learning, right? However, what if the schools are not safe? because of the earthquake, or because of tsunami, or because of some psychological bullying. It's a disaster. Man-made disaster plus nature-made disaster. So we are here together to talk about what are the issues and what are the priorities. Um, and I also share with you one question here today. Why do we need safe education? Okay. So, um, Education, I culture, and science for better quality of life. I hope we do. And uh, these are our member countries. So you have uh, their pioneering members, Indonesia, Malaysia, Singapore, Cambodia, Vietnam, Timor-Leste, Laos, Philippines, Thailand, Brunei, and Myanmar. 30 provinces that have a high risk. So only four provinces that it means that in the safe uh, areas. And from... 30 provinces. In the physical fight, these are global data, with another student at least once in the last 12 months, and almost one in three, 32.4%, have been physically attacked globally at least once in the last 12 months. We had a 2012 nationwide campaign on the child protection policy. Of course, the teachers were not receptive. They also wanted, just recently, I reviewed a The last bill. one is where we were engaged, uh, we were partnered with UNESCO and uh, UNICEF to create the mainstreaming CDRR in education microplanning. Uh, if not reinforced and if reinforced. If school buildings are not reinforced to seismic uh, standards, they may be severely damaged by aspects like figure 3 and 4. So research showed that each school building has their own characteristics in terms of physical environment. Mm -hmm. Most of uh, school parents think that uh, they are under common situation uh, in terms of physical environment. Mm -hmm. If you look at uh, the map of Gorkha, <coughs> the, the, we call it Gorkha earthquake because the epicenter is uh, at Gorkha, Gorkha district, one of the districts of Nepal. Uh, infrastructure, protection, livelihood, and camp management. It is also connected to uh, the committees that are in the provinces. So in the Solomon Islands, 